Welcome Libras. I'm back guys. I'm back with another video. If you are new to the channel, come on in guys. Click the bell to subscribe so you won't miss out on future videos. This is going to be a general read for my Libras. Okay, Libras for the month of September. Um, September 15th through the 30th. What messages do we have for my Libras? Okay, y'all don't mind my nail. I just popped a nail in this one. Like, they're just popping off, and I need to go ahead and take them off, or either get a full set. I already know, but y'all just bear with me. All right, so, um, if you guys want to order the money, magnet, the money Magnet Oil, the information is in the drop box below. Um, if you want to book a personal, the information is in the drop box below. All right, so I am running a three-card special, guys, for 11-11. Um, the cash shop is going to be in the description box below, okay? So you cash shop the 1111, you get a three-card reading, okay? If you would like a more in-depth reading, all that information, guys, all that things that you need is going to be in the description box below, all right? Keep in mind, guys, this is a general read, so don't come up in the comment section acting crazy telling me that, hey, this is not my story. That ain't got to go. It was them. I don't want to hear all of that, okay? Take what applies and leave the rest, okay? If it's vice versa, then it's vice versa because guess what? Your cross watchers are watching this video as well, okay? We got cross watchers. So energy is, you know, put it at where it needs to go, all right? So let's see what we got, Libras. All right, so Libra, for the remainder of September, September 15th through the 30th, what uh, message do we have for Libra? Well, you know what, Libra? I started doing, I did a collective read, and I think I'm going to continue to do the collective read like that. We're going to see your person feelings. We're going to put their feelings over here. We're going to put your feelings over here. We're going to put their feelings over here. All right, so let's talk about your person. Let's do it that way. Let's talk about your person and their feelings and how you feel about them. So how are, how are Libras viewing their person? Show me how Libras are viewed. Oh, something wanted to jump, but it did. Okay, we got the King of Swords. Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, you could be dealing with an air sign like yourself. Or you're feeling like this person is very, very much so, like, cutthroat. Okay, you feel like they are about their business with the Three of Pentacles. Mm-hmm. Um, there could be uh, talks about working towards something or building something here. Oh, yeah. See, definitely coming together. We got the Three of Cups. But we got, yeah, something. somebody disappointed because something ended or somebody was a part of a third-party situation or something in that nature. But I am getting that somebody is, somebody is disappointed. You're disappointed with this person or somebody missed the opportunity, okay? Because somebody, there could have been some type of betrayal or backstab or there was some type of ending. Give me one more card how does libra view their person yeah see we got the tower so something happened out of the blue something happened out of the blue you didn't see it coming there was a big awakening like something there was a shake up here there was some type of shake up moment here so you're viewing this situation as a tower okay so oh yes Oh, yeah. So you want this person to regret doing something. You want them to regret. You kind of want them to stay put. Um, But this is constantly like been on your mind with the nine of swords here. Yeah. The nine of swords is telling me that you've been thinking about this and you want this person to regret something that they did. They shook up your world. They possibly had you in a third party situation. Why is the three of cups here? Yep. Seven of swords. Somebody lied, cheated, sneak around. Okay, you possibly found this out and you were shocked. Like, what the hell? What the hell is going on here? Look at this. Queen of Swords. Yes, yeah, somebody got cut off and walked out and left. Okay. Yeah, somebody got somebody got cut off. They got cut off for lying, being sneaky, or cheating. Okay. Yeah. We got the devil. Could be dealing with the Capricorn. But this person, this situation was just negative. Okay. Negative. Why is the tower card here? The three of wands. Yeah, you didn't see this coming. Like, <clears throat> the Three of Wands is waiting for something to happen away, for the ships to come in. Maybe you saw this kind of come in, or you was waiting for this tower moment to come. But there was definitely a tower moment. There was definitely a shake up. Somebody, 
You found out that this person was a sneak, a liar, a cheat. Okay? And maybe this is the energy that you've been giving them, which is you guys' energy anyway. King of Swords. Y'all been being real blunt and cutthroat and, and being very blunt and honest with this person. Yes. Like, you see this person... You, in the future, we got the two of wands. You possibly saw this coming. You possibly did see this coming. Okay? You possibly saw this coming. Why is the king of swords here? The six of pentacles. Okay? Six of pentacles. Yeah, like, give it, you tried to give this person a chance to tell you something. You tried to give this person a chance to tell you the truth. But the way that those cards fell and how it happened, it was a mess. It just shook up everything and the tower moment just came in and just shook all of this up okay so how is this person viewing my libras Woo, libras all right so how do they view my libras how are they viewing my libras okay Okay, we got the Ten of Cups. We got the Knight of Pentacles, and we got the Sun card. You could definitely be dealing with the Water Sign, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. We got the Knight of Pentacles, which is Capricorn's energy, the Sun card, which is Leo's energy. Okay, so they're sensing, they're seeing, yeah, we got the Four of Wands and the Ace of Wands. Okay, so, and the Nine of Wands. So this person is viewing you as being, we got the Four of Wands. This is stable this is um family this could even be like a coming together or a community a community coming together some type of get this could have happened at some type of get together um the ace of wands is a new start a new home someone could possibly uh they could view you as some of you guys may just moved into a new home Somebody's watching somebody or somebody is telling somebody to be cautious. Like with the nine of wands, that's saying like, you know, putting a guard up. <clears throat> um, let's see. Why is the ten, why is the ten of cups here? They're viewing you as very happy. Why is the ten of cups here? The eight of swords. I'm getting looking everywhere for something. Um, hmm, why is the Six of Pentacles here? Oh, well, gee, that card just like literally flew. <laughs> flew out. All right, so we got the, okay, we got the Wheel of Fortune. Somebody just tried to give you a chance. They feel like they tried to give you a chance to do something here. And you didn't take the opportunity with the four of cups and the four of swords. Like you didn't take any action. They tried to give you a chance to take some type of action, but you didn't. Um, we got the knight of pentacles and the seven of pentacles. Yeah, lots of waiting energy. Like they feel like you drug your feet. I'm getting like you drag. They feel like you drag your feet. You move slow with the Knight of Pentacles. Like you take your time to do things. And they've been sitting here watching you with the Page of Swords. They've been sitting here watching you, spying on you. Um, and I feel like they're trying to give you an option or an ultimatum. Um, but they feel like you move slow. Like you taking your time to do something. Yeah, to take action. And I'm getting Leo's energy with the Queen of Wands and the Strength card here. Yeah, so there's like, they're waiting for you to take action, but you were dragging your feet. Somebody here with the Chariot card you could be dealing with the Cancer. But they want you to pick up the pace. They want you to pick up the pace. They want you to move quicker, quicker on a situation. And then we got the Sun card. Yeah, so... Why is the Eight of Wands here? Yeah, there's just like this shocking news. Like, there was definitely a surprise or some type of, you know, like something that happened out of the blue. Why 
Why is the tower card here? Yeah, surprise at the plan that something, something about surprise that somebody's plan worked or I'm getting that. Like somebody put a lot, somebody feels burdened. Somebody feels burdened, but somebody's intuition, their intuition was telling them <clears throat> not to say something or not to, uh, sh um, their intuition was telling them no about something, not to do something. Because they didn't want to take a risk. They didn't want to take that risk. But somebody is like too comfortable with the Ten of Wands and the King of Cups. Or it's too nice. Um, but their intuition is telling them to say no. Because they don't want to take the risk. Something may cost too much with the Nine of Pentacles. Um, but I'm getting like there's... They feel like you drag your feet and you're moving too slow. Um, there could have been a relationship here with the Ten of Pentacles that they were, uh, you know, they may feel like you're trying to keep them stuck in a situation, but they're trying to give you the chance to, you know, prove yourself to them. They feel like you could be dragging your feet, like you you taking your time, like what's taking you so long to take action? Why the Queen of Wands here? Nine of Swords, yeah. Yeah, like this is something that they constantly worry about, like they're worried. Then with the hermit card, definitely. This came out together before. It's like, what you doing? What's taking you so long? Yeah. I'm getting, what you doing? It's taking you a long time to, what is the hermit card here? The high priestess and the king of cups. Could be dealing with the Pisces or a cancer. Yeah, it's like something about regretting something later um, that you didn't take action or move forward because we got the King of Wands here and the Judgment, yeah, and the Six of Cups. Tried to give you a chance. That's what I'm getting. Tried to give you a chance to pick up the pace on something, but you decided to drag your feet. Um, why the Two of Wands here? I do want to see why the Two of Wands is here. Ooh, we got the Emperor and the Ace of Swords. So somebody here is speaking their truth. Somebody planned on, they planned on speaking their truth to you. And, and possibly in an aggressive way. Somebody here is coming off very aggressive with the emperor here. Somebody is coming off very much so like they, you know, run things. Like this person may be coming at you like they're your, you know, like, you know, they're superior over you. Um, and... I feel like you just you you taking your time. Your retaliation is okay. You want me to you want me to pick up my feet. You want me to you want me to uh, move on your time, but I don't move on your time. But somebody is definitely speaking with an aggressive uh, coming at someone aggressively. Why is the emperor here? Yeah, and King of Pentacles. I'm getting there. Could be an older person. This person uh, could be older than you. They feel like they, uh, you know, have authority over you. Maybe they paid for something with that King of Pentacles here. But, you know, you're not having it. Two of Swords and Three of Cups. You're not wanting to participate in it. You're not willing to participate in, in this little shindig that they got going on. Okay? Because I feel like, um, I feel like you feel like this person was being sneaky and, Doing little sneak stuff anyway. So you feel like, okay, well, I don't have to, you're not no honest person. You don't, you're not, you know, I don't have to pick up the pace for you. I don't have to do, I move on my own time. And I know that, Libras. <laughs> I know that. Give me a general read for Libras. Quick little general read, please, for my Libras. We got the Queen of Cups, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. We got the Hermit card, Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. We got the Ace of Swords. We got the Magician. We got the Tower again, like I said. Y'all just had a Tower moment. And then the Eight of Wands and the Three of Wands wanting to come out. Like, you're waiting for this person to say something. I get that you want to speak your truth to this person. 
Um, you want to speak your truth, okay? Why is the magician here? Yeah, the Ten of Cups. Like, ooh, somebody's going to regret. You want them to regret something that they said, okay? You want to make this person regret something that they said. We got the Queen of Wands, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. Like I said, you're taking your slow little time with the Seven of Pentacles and the Knight of Pentacles. Like, you're moving at your own pace. But you're going to make them, you're going to make them eat those words that they said. Why is the Ace of Swords here? What did they say? The Two of Cups. Somebody needed to speak their truth about being in a relationship or a connection that they have. Okay. I get that somebody's playing mind games here. Somebody was playing mind games with somebody. Why is the two of cups here? Yeah, the ace of wands, okay, and the five. Yeah, this started an argument, okay? I see with the ace of wands and the five of wands, definitely an argument uh, was taking place, okay? This started, this fueled the fire. Why is the queen of cups here? Six of wands. Six of wands. So if there was an altercation, like there's been some type of disagreement, um, I feel like so you might feel like this person wants some wants some attention or want to win the battle or want to win this argument, okay, or want to put their input. Why is the hermit card here and the three of pentacles? Yeah, something you feel like <clears throat> we got a hermit card here, three of pentacles could be done with the Virgo. Three of pentacles is working together or, or three people here. Um, Someone could be could have been looking for um, assistance, but somebody doesn't have the resources or doesn't have isn't independent or self reliant. Okay, because I got the four of cups and the, the nine of pentacles. Why is this tower here? Queen of Swords and the Hangman. Yeah, like. There was just something that happened out of the blue. The Four of Wands and the Lovers, Gemini energy. Four of Wands is definitely like that came out previously. This could be a home life situation. This could be a group setting. This could have happened in between a group of people. Because of the Three of Pentacles here. But the Hangman is saying like, you know, you was waiting for this to pop up. You was waiting for this to pop up. You was waiting for this to happen. You, you saw this coming. You already saw this coming. You saw it coming. But now you're waiting for this person to say something to you moving ahead. Like, you're waiting for this person to reach out to you. You're waiting to see what they're going to say. You're waiting to see, like, yeah, like, you're waiting to see what they gonna have, what they got to say. Yep, you're waiting on a response for them. Um, I feel like you... You're going to end up being restless because you may not hear from this person right away. Okay. But I feel like you saw this coming. You saw this coming. You saw this coming. Like you saw this disagreement coming. You saw it coming. All right, Libras. Y'all let me know what's going on in the comment section below. All right. Talk to y'all later. Ciao.